150 years ago, invisible dangers lurked hidden. But one man, one of the founders of bacteriology, arose to liberate mankind from this evil. He exposed highly contagious bacteria, fought against deadly pathogens, and finally founded the institute which would later bear his name, and which had only one very important objective in mind, to protect people against diseases. His name, Robert Koch. But whenever he thought a danger had been averted, a new and even more powerful enemy emerged, one much tougher and more deceitful than its predecessor. He laid the foundation for a team of professionals able to confront the worst diseases known to mankind. With meticulous observation and state-of-the-art technology, they compile the information necessary to work out what actually makes people sick and what keeps them healthy. They research diseases at all levels, infectious ones, such as COVID-19 and measles, non-infectious ones, such as diabetes and cancer, as well as their risk factors. In doing so, they also rely on a network of many other specialists in Germany and throughout the world. Specialists just as dedicated to people's welfare as a RKI, and that every day of the week. The experts at the Robert Koch Institute focus on the health of the population as a whole. In other words, their main concern is public health. They provide the data for activities designed to ensure, ideally, that such health problems will not occur in the first place. And in this way, they are unique in using their vast knowledge to protect us against health hazards. They are also globally active helping to recognize and contain outbreaks of diseases and assessing the risk of new pathogens. They use both tried and tested methods and technologies and completely new approaches with the help of artificial intelligence, machine learning and computer simulations, health risks can be identified even more swiftly. They investigate their enemy precisely so as to be ready and waiting before it is able to develop into full strength. And they pass on their knowledge. Because whether yesterday, today or tomorrow, they are fighting for us and for our health. <laughs>